So this is a little pathway at Scottsdale Community College, Desert Landscape. There's probably going to be bird feathers from the doves sitting up in that tree. Maybe nest material. This is the coolest place. And this is the best time of day, sunset, to see wildlife. So here's what I'm here for. This little bottle of Pellegrino is going to become a rattle. I'm going to pick that up today. What I can't pick up right now, because I don't have my bucket, is this. These incredible little seed pods. If you break them open, very hard seeds come out. <coughs> and between the pods and the seeds, you can put them in a glass bottle and make a rattle. I'm all clean. It's time to go home. So on my way back from foraging at Scottsdale Community College, um, once I had put my camera away and I was carrying too much stuff to stop um, and take the camera back out, I found the coolest, creepiest thing. Check it out. That, my friends, is a dead toad. I don't think they're indigenous. They remind me of the cane toads from Australia when they're not withered and dry and have no head. But uh, it's all bones and creepy frog legs and skin that gives you warts. So the decision is, do I, do I get the skin off and just use the bones? Do I leave the skin on? What do I put it in? I don't know, but I'm taking Froggy home. Toadie? I'm taking Toadie home. That's what I found. <laughs>